I could wake up in the morning and know that I'm not going to the hospital for a sickle cell crisis. Dr. Rundelli and Dr. Seraph was working on this uh, experiment with a transplant for stem cells. Then they said you had to find a, a donor, which had to be a full sibling. So uh, three, the three of us, you know, same mother, same father, and uh, they tested Desmond, and uh, it was a match. And then my mom was like, you know, if you're testing Desmond, you know, you might as well test Julius too, because he's going through it, you know, I was going to the hospital like every month. So they tested me, and uh, it was a 10 out of 10 match, man, for me, I, I, Clifford, and Desmond. So it was like a miracle, man. Like God works in mysterious ways. I mean, I thought I was about to live my life out with this horrible disease, you know, and boom, here it just comes, gets taken away. To go do it, they had to lower my, our immune system with uh, the camp path drug, which is like a form of chemotherapy, but it's not, but it is. And, um, you know, because if you don't lower your immune system, once you get the stem cells, you could reject them because your immunity is going to fight them off because you have these weird cells coming in and trying to fix everything up. The doctors were pretty cool. The uh, transplant team was good. Uh, I had a I had a good experience, you know. I, I had my game, my PlayStation. Uh, my girlfriend was up there. My mom, my dad was coming and visiting me. So, you know, I was ordering a lot of food. You know, a lot of ice cream, Jello, stuff like that. I feel like I can do anything. I feel like I can fly. It feels like a mountain being moved out of my way. You know, I, I don't have to. This is not hovering over my head. I'm gonna beat sickle cell. I'm not gonna let sickle cell beat me. That's how I would look at it. I would definitely recommend coming to UI Health to get tested if you have full siblings for sickle cell because it's awesome. And hey, you look at me. Oh, yeah.